Edinburgh University were already leading in the women's varsity match, courtesy of a try from centre Lisa Thompson. Edinburgh certainly enjoying the early possession here, and an offside penalty. So scrum half, Louise Pullen drive over for the second try. Once again, Lisa Thompson involved in the build-up here. Hattie Cumber almost making it to the line. Pullen feeds out and Thompson dots down. Then it was from deep for Thompson, breaking two tackles, good dummy, and doing just enough to hold off St Andrews left winger Comfort Ogbonaya for a try under the posts. Edinburgh then had led 24-0 at half time, and into the second half, Sally Stott, their number eight, scores. St Andrews, though, were not to be outdone. And from this quickly taken tap penalty, an out of the back of the hand pass from Rhiannon Fox Rothwell set up a try for their number eight, Fiona Cooper. A popular score. Edinburgh, though, looked to finish with a flourish. And with Lisa Thompson acting as provider, her standoff, Helen Nelson, touches down. So, a victory for Edinburgh University by 36 points to 7. And Captain Katie Dugan accepted the trophy and then went to celebrate with her teammates. To the men's match, the world's oldest varsity match, and what a cracking contest it was, watched by a crowd of 9,679 on the international pitch at BT Murrayfield. St Andrews made a cracking start. An open side flanker, Ruri Bell, exploited the narrow side for the opening try. Five minutes later, some neat interplay in the backs. And from the breakdown, Murphy and his full back set up Scott Doherty. Nimble footwork from the 10 and Murphy blazes in support for try number two. It had been an unselfish roll by Doherty in that try, but for try number three, he muscles over from close range. That was a 17-0 lead for St Andrews. Edinburgh then got a toehold into the game. And referee awards the try for Callum Simpson, a fourth year mechanical engineering student. St Andrews at this point were down to 13 men, two in the sin bin, Edinburgh pressing, scrum advantage, and scrum half Sandy Robson escapes for their second try. Edinburgh then had fought back, and into the second half, this juggle from replacement standoff Will Stephen set up their third score. St Andrews had regained the lead through a penalty. Edinburgh pressing again. And sub scrum half Ian Vance escapes for their try. Edinburgh back in the lead, 26 points to 20.
the last play of the game. St Andrews seeking to protect ball. Doherty, Murphy, and then Rory Gardner in at the corner. All eyes on 18 year old Murphy, the scrum half. And what a conversion! St Andrews win 27 points to 26, their third successive victory in the varsity match. Captain George Hailstone raises the trophy. Well done, St Andrews. <laughs>